Today it's Cinco de Mayo. So tonight we're gonna make taco soup. It's a favorite of ours and it's super easy. Before we get started, let me show y'all what I use in my taco soup. We have two cans of ranch style beans. One is jalapeno, one is original. Two cans of corn, two cans of tomato. One is tomato sauce, one is diced tomatoes. Two packages of ranch, two packages of taco seasoning. I use like a half a stick of butter in with whenever I do my meat, I'm browning that. I have one onion that I'm gonna dice up. And this is two pounds of meat. I have one pound of hamburger meat and one pound of deer meat. And then of course, we got cheese. So if we need an extra seasoning, this is what I use It's nature seasoning. It's got garlic, pepper, salt, onion mix. So it's got everything in it. So if I need anything extra, I put that in there. So I'm dicing up my onion. I like to do small pieces. I'm trying to keep my fingers out of the way because I have a bad habit of cutting my fingers. So I'm gonna use my half a stick of butter. Put that in there. I'm gonna put my heat on medium. Add the meat in there. We have all this onion. I'm just gonna let this brown and cook some of that onion up. And that'll usually take about 10 minutes. going to continue to stir, keeping it mixed up. Okay, getting everything ready to put in the soup. You do not have to strain anything except for the corn. Do not use that water that's in the corn. That's disgrace. Just don't. <laughs> it's gross. Pretty much everything is done. Hamburger meat is ready. We're about to add the rest of our ingredients in here. Take your cans, dump it all in there, nothing special. You're special. I'm special. Like I said, don't put the corn water in there. That's just gross. That's so sick. You add your own water or add beef broth to it if you want to Add some seasoning, more seasoning in the water. Okay. So I added two cans of water. I used my tomato cans just to get the rest of that tomato sauce and everything out. Give it a stir. Now I'm gonna add my seasoning. I use, like I said, two packs of taco seasoning. Some people use just one. One great thing about this meal, you do not have to stand over your stove to cook it. You just mix everything together, mix it up really good, and just let it sit there. That's what I like about it. So I'm giving it its last stir. I'm going to turn this down to low and just leave it along for about 15 minutes. Then we'll come back and we'll eat. So we've had this simmering for about 15 minutes. I'm going to turn it off. And we're going to fix the bowl and see how this tastes. Which I know would be good because I made it. So I'm going to put what I like to have on my soup, which is some cheese. And then a little dollop of sour cream. Let's give this a try and see how it is. So 
That's really good. So I hope y'all enjoy this recipe as much we do. So give it a try. Okay, guys, don't forget to subscribe to our channel at God's Country Southern Cooking. And until next time, y'all enjoy.